Hey guys, it's Aspen. Today I'm working with CoverGirl and we are putting a spin on your average makeup routine. This is Wheel of Beauty, brought to you by CoverGirl. First I'm gonna spin the wheel to find out my makeup theme. Then I'm gonna receive a bag filled with makeup products that I can use. Let's get to it. So let's spin the wheel. I've never actually done this before, so I'm kinda scared to see what it lands on. Looks like it landed on red carpet inspired, which is perfect because it is red carpet season, so I actually have some ideas. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, so I have been given this makeup bag to work with. I'm really excited to see what's in here. I love challenges like this, so see what's inside. So the first thing is the True Naked Goldens palette. Next, I see this True Blend face primer. The CoverGirl Plumpify Blast Row Mascara. CoverGirl Outlast Long Wear Lipstick. True Naked Waterproof Eyeliner Duo. So my last thing in here is the Bombshell Powder Brow and Liner. So all of these look really great. I'm excited to put together a look for you guys. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing I'm gonna do is start off with eyeshadow. So this is the first eyeshadow I'm using and it is cream. So this is gonna go on the inner half of my lid. And my eye look is kind of going to be inspired by Zendaya and her classic red carpet look. She's always got really pretty glowy eyes. She has like a strong brow. And it is red carpet inspired, so it's like neutral but glam at the same time. So next I'm going to use the second shade down. This one's kind of more shimmery. So I'm going to put this on the outer half of my eyelid. And next I'm going to take the third eyeshadow. This is like a matte brown color. Just kind of blend it in. These eyeshadows are pretty blendable. They're also really pigmented, which is nice. So next I'm going to take the darkest color in the palette and I'm just taking a little brush and I'm going to just do like the outer V of my eyes to kind of define it and darken it and you can totally just like add more until you get your desired effect. All right, so I think that looks pretty good. I just added a little bit more and kind of blended it out. Next, we're going to do eyeliner and I'm actually going to take the Espresso side and I'm just gonna line my upper lash line with this. I'm trying to keep it kind of neutral, so I'm just gonna add a little bit of this and then I can kind of like smoke it out. Also, it's okay if you mess up a little bit. I do every single time and we're going to blend it out. And I'm just gonna do this like on my waterline. And CoverGirl seriously has the best mascaras ever. I've tried so many of them. I actually have eyelash extensions in right now, so I'm just gonna use a little bit of this. It's supposed to lift your lashes and give them volume. I haven't used mascara in so long, I miss this. I love CoverGirl mascara. So I'm just gonna apply that, and I am gonna put it on my bottom lashes. This is like their biggest brush ever. It's really awesome. I think my eyes are finished. So moving on to this True Blend face primer. So I have not used this before. I'm excited to try it out. I'm always looking for a good primer. So I'm just putting it on my fingers and I'm putting it pretty much just all over my face. But I am focusing on like the parts where I get oily. So I'm just blending that out. That goes on really smooth, wow. All right, so my skin is prepped and all that good stuff that primer does. This is a red carpet look, so I'm just gonna apply foundation. So I'm just taking my foundation brush and I'm just going to put some of this on my skin to even it out. This foundation's going on pretty smooth because of that primer. It has like a really silky kind of feel. Okay, so I have my foundation on. Now we're gonna move on to brows and brows are so important. They frame the face. They totally just make your look. I'm gonna start kind of out here and just like very carefully apply a little bit. Kind of just like following the shape of my eyebrow. And then I'm gonna take this. This is just like a plain spoolie brush, like plain mascara wand type thing. And I'm going to be brushing it out as I'm doing this to keep it looking like really natural. That looks good. All right, and then I'm just blending. Just blending everything. That's the key to good makeup. Okay, now I'm gonna do the other eyebrow. And this is my bad eyebrow. Have you guys seen those things on Twitter that's like, one of your eyebrows like does yoga and like all that. And then the other one just like doesn't have its life together. That is this eyebrow for me. So this is gonna be, actually it looks really good. I take that back. This is a good eyebrow today. 
All right, so those are my eyebrows. They turned out so good today. Now we're going to move on to lips. So this is the Outlast Longwear Plus Moisture. So this is gonna keep my lips moisturized. I really like this color. So I'm just applying some of this. And blending, of course. So this is my final red carpet inspired look. So let me know how you guys think I did in the comments down below. I think I did pretty good if I do say so myself. Also make sure to check out the playlist so you guys can see at future episodes of the series. Make sure to subscribe to Awesomeness TV and also check out covergo.com if you guys want to learn about any of these products or get some other tips and tricks. So I will see you guys later on Wheel of Beauty. Bye!